All right, today we got one that's uh, you don't see too often. It's a Tram D300. It's in really nice shape. It's not mint. There's a few little marks that you'll find, I'm sure. On the top, the chrome is pretty nice. There's a couple spots. Right there on the chrome, you can see a little mark there. Overall though, fantastic looking radio. Uh, the radio comes with, this is a registration card, which I don't think you can use anymore. The uh, Tram D300 uh, owner's manual. The original Tram handling that goes with it. Uh, this radio is old and pretty rare, so I'm going to sell it as is. If you don't agree to that, don't buy it. Please don't buy it. I don't want any problems or issues. With these old radios, it's working right now. It could work fine for another 10 years. It could go down tomorrow. You know, it's if you plan on keeping this radio to talk on, I would definitely suggest going through and replacing all of the electrolytic capacitors. This radio sat for a long time. The meter lights in it are even original. Uh, there's th Those haven't been changed or the original lights, so sure those could go at any time as well. Um, there's no mods done to the radio at all, and it's not where there were mods and they were put back. There's just never been any mods to this. Uh, audio limiters are not clipped. Um, no channels, nothing, no variable power, nothing like that. All the switches on the front here operate as they did when it was new. But uh, I'll give you a, a demonstration of it. Uh, we're on AM right now. So I'm going to go ahead and go over to my meter here. And we're going to key up the tram original mic. We're on the 20 watt scale. So. Now we're dead key in a little over three watts. Audio check. Audio check. Hello. You know, I don't know, 12 watts. Audio. Hello. In between 10 and 15, so 12 watts or so. Um, and that's, that's on AM. So if we uh, flip it over to lower side, lower side band. Audio, hello, about the same, and the same with upper side band. Audio, hello. So it is a uh, all stock, no mods. Let's see if anybody's on side band. We can receive on these. It's really good. Station by Yeah, of course there's nobody out there now. I mean it does work. Side hand does work. I made some good contacts on that. <coughs> Break 19, how about a radio check? Is this radio working? I appreciate it, driver. Thank you, drive safe. Have a good one. He was really muffled. That's not the receive on the radio, so that's just how he sounded. But uh, really nice radio, and like I said, you know, it, it's going to be sold as is. Please don't buy it if you don't plan on ever having to do anything to it. This thing is old. You know, you're looking at, I believe, about 30, 35 years old. It sat for a number of years. And again, everything is original in it. So things will start to go. And like I said, if you plan on using this for an everyday talk or anything, I'll definitely get all the electrolytic capacitors replaced, do a tune-up on it. And, but uh, I will take uh, several more pictures um, of the 
entire radio, you know, front and back, bottom and everything. It's clean. It's clean. And then it's got the original speaker also that comes with it. So it's really hard to find this radio with the manual, mic, everything in this kind of shape that's never been uh, modified and hacked up. So um, I'm not going to sell it cheap, that's for sure. It's, uh, But I, I will make it fair. I mean, uh, you know, I'm going to do free shipping. I do package these well. I don't just uh, throw them in a box with a piece of newspaper. Um, I do use bubble wrap, and, and I make sure they're packed very well. Uh, I'll ship FedEx, and uh, I will insure it, and I'll pay for all of that. So keep in mind that the material, uh, the shipping, the insurance, all that's included in the price. So thank you uh, very much, and uh, I'm sure the winner of this auction will definitely enjoy this radio, and take care.